What's up guys, Sonic here, bringing you the first ever video of the Sonic Gaming Channel. So this is my backup account, Sonic Gaming. You know, coming along a little bit. Giant similar to my main account, Sonic. <laughs> So right now we're going to look at a great 3 star Goho style attack. So this is the war we're currently losing. I apologize for any audio issues, I do not have a good microphone, that might come at a later date, who knows. Let's look at attack number one. Don't want to talk about attack number two, it's pretty rough. Okay, so by the looks of this base, you do have these air defenses well protected. Not very well protected, decent. So immediately I'm thinking, okay, this is a perfect opportunity to try out a ground attack. As you can see, I only have level four hogs and level one golems. So I really need to get those upgraded. The hogs will be level five and about. Two hours, the golem will start coming after the hogs. So immediately I noticed the town hall, the queen, and the barb king are all together and they're all on this side. So I see, alright, that's a perfect place to start some sort of funnel. That's a perfect place to direct my kill squad. So what I do first is I think, okay, I'm gonna get a widespread on this goal. Start the funneling up the wizards. You want your kill squad, which is like your golems, your wizards, and your heroes, to take out the biggest threats to a hawk. Clan castle, the archer, and any double die bomb. So I know I can easily take out at least the clan castle, and then double die bombs, I'm going to negate those with two um, heal spells. And so I was feeling pretty confident going into the raid, so let's just kind of watch it right now. So here we go, there we go. So, I start out with a very wide temple. This is so they can tank this building, this building, this building. Archer tower, cannon, that mortar, possibly this mortar once I go into the second apartment. And I did bring six wall breakers just to break open these to get the wall. So as a goal set going, I get the wizard right behind me. They're gonna start the funnel drop. Take out those trash buildings. So my heroes don't walk around the outside. So, funneling, I drop the heroes. All they can help out with, with funneling. Wall breakers go down. They bust open the walls. The golems start going. Once those walls are open, I place them. One thing people do a lot that you do not want to do is they place their king barb down too early. What will happen is the king barb will actually get in front of the golems and he will start taking all the damage in the defense building. And you do not want that to happen. You want your golems to be doing all the time. So the archer comes in. There goes my barb. I do that because the golem is in front of him. So no matter where the barb king goes right now, the golem, which is about to take it down a very weak air defense, will stay in front. And this archer queen, I really want to kill her. So, big problem. She's behind the wall. So what do I do to negate that? I drop a nice jump right in front of me. That allows my golem to get into that apartment. My king hops in there. One shot that game. Now, the one thing that I did not want to happen was this golem attracted the attention of the playing house before this. I wanted them to go this way so the queen would take them out. But that's not what happened. Luckily, I have two poison stars. So we move forward. Barb King, I rage him up, he takes out that Barb King and the skeleton. Two poison stars. Help take out these wounds of the dragon. Along with that one wizard, put in work. So the poison cells go down. Everything's looking alright. So all the balloons are down. All that's left is this dragon. Now, the problem is my queen over there is beating up on that town hall. So she's not looking at the enemy dragon. So I use her rage. So she will quickly get through that town hall and 
take out that dragon before he kills my king. This dragon comes very close. So the wizards are am I arguing? Take out the dragon. The king's still alive. So now I get a pretty good push on my kill squad. I take out the town hall. I more importantly I take out the clan castle and the enemy heroes. So now I'm gonna start the hog rider portion of this attack. So what I do is I bring two giants, just mini tanks. They don't really do a whole lot, but they do a little bit. So I place one down right there. And I start to hog the hog So that way these defense are giant, hogs the move, they start to count. I hit them up with a steel spell, as down, same thing out here. Giant, hog, range spell on. So they start busting food in. As you can see, they do it over my job, not the best. Really want to move for my hunt rider. Luckily, he'll be level five by the next floor. Now, here's the saving grace. As you can see, I have one hog that's about to die. So I have no more hog left besides this one. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six defense. So, luckily. Adam hitting me up with those level five hog riders in the clan castle. They come out and just put in absolute push. There goes one defense. Here they come and take out a second. Now they head over to this company. And this is where things get real interesting. I noticed there's a good chance there's two uh, giant bombs right here. So I place down a heal spell. There's one. Heal spells keep them up. There's two heal spells keep them up. They keep going. They take out this Tesla. Then there's just one defense left, which is that arc. They take down. My queen is still going. Now she's a great day the fight. I drop two more wizards, six archers, three barbs, I believe, to help clean up process. We're just racing. Um, I was a little worried, I'm not gonna lie. A lot of buildings left that we had to go through. But, okay. Moving in, how I also brought one goblin. So, get the job done. Take out the build, all the buildings. Perfect to restart with only 10 seconds left. And that's pretty much it, guys. That's how you do a really good go ho golems and hog riders style attack you gotta funnel you gotta take out that clan castle and those enemy heroes and hopefully if all goes well you use your heal spells real smart you can get a good three stars and that's pretty much how it's done um thank you guys for tuning in i'll be trying to bring more content maybe one video a week maybe more i don't know how it's going um this is sonic from sonic gaming uh signing out thank you guys very much for watching